Hello, I'm Carol Sparge, and I'm here with Joel Johnson, managing partner of Johnson Brunetti. And Joel, today we're talking about pensions. When is it better to take a monthly payment or a lump sum? Well, it's a great question. There's a few key things people need to know about pensions, but this is probably the first big decision that most people are going to face. If you work for a big giant company right now, they kind of want you to take the lump sum and get the money out of their pension plan. It's costing them a lot of money to have the money in that pension plan, but a lump sum sim simply means I roll the money over into my own 401k. Taking the monthly payments is real simple. It's just taking the monthly payments that are guaranteed for life. So it's really important people examine this decision. There's not one right way for everybody, but I would say most people now, if they have the opportunity to take the lump sum and roll it over, they tend to do that. And what else is to consider? Well, there's the timing of the pension payments, right? So some people, the pension gets triggered automatically the day you retire. That would be things like military pensions and, and so on. But for most of us, if we work for a big company, we have an option of when to take that pension. If I retire at 60, I might be able to take it at 60. Maybe I can defer it until 65. So the timing of those payments need to coordinate with the rest of your retirement savings. They should be part of an overall financial plan. And one more thing. One more thing, and this gets a little complicated. So when you take a pension, if you take the monthly payments, you have all of these different options. So I'm married to Wendy. I could take payments just for my own benefit, and the day I die, she gets zero. That's gonna be the highest payment option. The second thing I could do is I could begin to reduce my payments, and then if I die first, she continues to get what we call a survivor benefit. There's also something called term certain, where I could just say, pay me the whole thing out over 20 years or 30 years or, or something like that. And I can do a combination of all three of these. So it gets pretty complicated. It's really important that somebody looks at the mathematics of all these decisions, but also takes into account things like life expectancy and other retirement savings. And you do have a free offer. Yeah, I've got a book I wrote called The Lump Sum Pension Payment Guide. And it's the eight critical things that you need to answer before you make this decision. It may be one of the biggest financial decisions you make how to take that pension. Joel, thank you. And you can get the free book by going to bettermoneyatlanta.com. Again, that's bettermoneyatlanta.com.